everybody, Isaac here with Civil Engineering Academy, jumping on real quick to do some fun reviews with you. I'm actually, um, got was gifted these books from School of PE to do some reviews on, and I wanted to share those reviews with you if you're studying for your Civil PE depth exam. So what the School of PE has done is they've released depth manuals for those taking uh, the, the Civil Engineering PE exam. These are preview editions. If I could just show you one of them. This is a preview edition. This one specifically is for water resources, but these are preview editions. So what the School of PE is doing is they are allowing people, uh, if you are a member of their course, to get these manuals as part of their courses. So if you wanna go check out their courses, go to civilengineeringacademy.com slash SOPE. You can go check these out. You can see right off the bat that these books these review manuals are various thicknesses and I talk about this in each review but basically what you're getting here is a lot of material is covered in the AM uh, and if it is covered in the AM then it's found in their uh, review manuals for the AM for the PM portion you're getting stuff that's in uh, the PE spec but uh, like structures or construction as you or here well, what's this construction depth review you can see it's not very thick. And the reason for that is because most of that is covered in the AM portion. But you can see for transportation, this is the thickest book. Check that out. This thing is huge. So that's the thickest book, but, um, and the reason why is because there's not a lot of material for the depth portion, right? Currently in the specifications, there's just no, not a lot of topics. So you gotta cover a lot in a depth section review manual. So anyway, School PE has, has let me use these. I did a quick review of each video, which is um, what I wanted to share with you. Uh, and hopefully you will understand what I think these are great manuals as you check out the review itself. Um, but I overall, I think they're uh, great books and definitely worth checking out. So stay tuned, it's coming right up. A review of each of these manuals is coming right up. All right, so here we are checking out School of PE's PE exam review guide for the construction depth. This is the book that they've uh, obviously just released. Um, this again is for the PE civil review guide uh, for the construction depth exam. You can see right there. Now, what you're gonna notice when you get this guy is that it's not as thick as some of their other review manuals. So you might be wondering what's up with that. And the reason why that is, is because the review manual for construction is heavily covered already in the civil PE specs from the NCES in the morning portion of the exam. So the reason why they released a depth review guide that is a little thinner than probably their other review manuals, I'll just show a quick comparison here. See, other review manuals, construction's the thinnest. And the reason for that is because it's covered mainly in AM portion of the exam. So you open this up, what I noticed real quickly is that we've got colored pages, which is super nice. Chapter one's earthwork construction and layout. Uh, chapter two, estimating quantities and cost. Chapter three, construction operations and methods. Four, scheduling. Five, material quality control and production. Chapter six, temporary structures. Uh, seven, health and safety, so all your OSHA stuff. Then we get into the instructors. Looks like Dr. Allen, good guy. And then you've got Dr. Dong. So you can read about their bios right there. What's nice about when they produce these books, is that they always get instructors that have um, specialization in these topics. So you got Dr. El Gamal in there as well. Not doctor, sorry, but uh, Mr. El Gamal. And then you've got uh, Niraj Kumar. You can read all about their bios in here, but you can read all about them. Good stuff. Technical reviews, editorial staff, so they do all that. And then you start diving into the chapters. So if you dive into these chapters, first thing I notice is that they list an exam guide at the beginning. They list the approximate number of questions based on the specifications, right? And that will change as the specs change. 
Commonly used abbreviations are listed here, and then they start into the introduction and then the material. What's nice is that after major sections, they do provide example problems uh, as part of this as well. So you get that in these books, you get example problems discussing the topics and how, um, you know, how you, you really solve these problems. So tables are provided. This is something you can tab up and mark up as you go through it yourself. But, um, you know, I'm not gonna go through every single page, but just to give you a feel and flavor, you can see that you've got colored graphs in here, graphs and tables, figures. You've got practice problems. It goes over everything that the specification's gonna be covering for you, which is super nice. Um, and that's really it. Now, one of the things you'll notice that is missing from here that they've kind of been pushing uh, on their latest guides, especially the AM portion uh, guide, is that they don't have their total AR codes in here yet. Um, that's something they're gonna be working on because the PE is going to be going computer-based in 2022 because of COVID that was accelerated. But um, in the future, they will have those total AR codes in this construction manual book. Uh, for This is specifically for your depth section for your construction. So it's like gonna, it'll help you with your AM too, but you wanna get the other book that's associated with this guy um, as part of it. Soft cover book, uh, all the depth manuals are soft cover. Um, it does cover the material you need and it provides plenty of practice problems. Uh, and it's just an overall, an excellent, you know, another piece of study material that's gonna really help you out on your PM portion of the exam. And that is for the construction uh, depth exam. So School PE is getting really good at producing these. I like what they're doing. Again, construction is thinner than other review manuals and that's because it is covered a lot heavily uh, in their AM review guide. So there you go guys, hope you enjoyed a little glimpse at the construction depth review guide. I definitely would recommend getting it if you were looking for additional resources, go check it out at civilengineeringacademy.com slash S-O-P-E. You'll be taken to school P and you can go grab this guide yourself. So really enjoyed it, check it out, thanks. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Just a quick review of these manuals. Uh, thanks for School of PE for sending those and allowing me to do a quick review. Again, you have to be a course member to be able to get access to those. So if you need that, go to civilengineeringacademy.com SOPE. But in 2022, 2022 and beyond, they will be released out into the public. So you can go check those out as well and get a version, even if you're not a course member, as they add more to it. So. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that quick review of these manuals and uh, we'll see you in the next one. But hey, check out those cool mountains. <laughs>